Hey love bugs, it's Rosalyn back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome into my returning subs, my grown extended beautiful family. Just thank you so much for the love and support that you're giving me as, as well as yourself and others along the way. And so with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if if you've been watching my videos for a while and have not already, what are you waiting for? Like and subscribe, even hit that notification bell so you know when your girl's about to upload the next video. And if you are comfortable enough, please go ahead and drop me a line or two. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me, even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video, or you're just up telling me about your empathic gift and how it impacted your life and hit you towards a positive direction. And also, if you feel like the videos just gave you good vibes or even good for information that you would love to share with a loved one or a friend, please go ahead and do so. And while you're at it, give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites, wherever you see fit. And once again, thank you so much for showing my channel love and support and I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video and today I'm listening to open your third eye chakra sleep chakra meditation balancing healing calm sleep meditation music and I will post that link in the description box below and today my video is about twin flame 101 empaths on the journey for self-discovery yes on the journey to self-discovery you know there are so many of us that don't know our purpose you know we're trying to find that one thing in, that we connect to in life because it's just like if you're all over the place it can be really frustrating and it's just like some there has been some people that you know they're telling me Rosalind I just found out I'm a, a shaman or Rosalind I just found out was, you know I have a twin flame or I'm, I'm a, um, a spiritual healer so it's just like they're trying to figure out you know how can they be on that best version of themselves how do I need to get there and it's just like if we have you know we're automatically you know you know what your talent is you you love to help people you love to make people happy see other people smile and it's just like but you're going through these issues and it's just like with us empaths we can always tell people hey you're, this is wrong with you this problem wrong with you and this is wrong with you but when it comes to ourselves we can get clueless at sometimes so it's just like when you're you know you're starting your life all back over because it seems like God will allow you to give your own self a train wreck so he can be able to put things back together for you in a different perspective so it's just like first and foremost you always have to forgive yourself first you know you got a long list of people that you know just probably hurt you along the way neglected you abandoned you and you know just made your life turn upside down so it's just like when you're going through that spiritual awakening you have something that has shaken up your life either you lost somebody you know you're going through a divorce or you know going through a heartache that you never thought you had to go through you know somebody must have passed anything that is able to bring your life to that hope to where it's like okay it's telling you your body your soul is telling you hey something has to give something has to change you're on this verge for a reason you're you're having this mishap for a reason and you know when you're on that self-discovery you have to find the things that make you happy find the things that can complete you not other people because other people cannot complete you you know a lot of people are like oh well I want to find this I want to find that but you can't find it in other people until you can find it within yourself you can't have things you know come towards you until you are okay with yourself you are fine with yourself you know there was when I first started my situation you know went crazy because I did not I didn't like listening to the voices in my head I didn't like being alone with my thoughts I didn't like being alone but now it's just like when I have that solace and I have that solitude where I can get that that peace of mind where when I need to be by myself I can think of the things that I need to change or be able to analyze my dreams as they come because it's just like um, my outlet is this you know telling y'all about this you know I have you know a, a close amount of people that I talk to which is good too you don't need a lot of people in your life like that um and it, it was just like it brought me peace I was able to know okay this is 
this is all these things collaborated in my life because a lot of us don't realize we're multi-gifted you know and it's like when we're on that journey you'll start finding out more things you're connecting with more more things like I when I first started I just thought I was a twin flame indigo and then come to find out I'm an INFJ I have traits of that then I have you know a twin you know not the, just the twin flame but the white witch and all these different things that place along against that now I'm able to play off of those things I'm able to use those things to the best of my advantage to be able to help others as well as myself so this is a blessing I love what I do and I tell y'all that a lot. I really love what I do because there's so many of us that are just now starting. Don't understand why am I going through this girl? Do I need to go get a therapist? Am I going crazy? I thought I was about to lose my mind. But when you're on that road to self, uh, self-discovery, it's a beautiful experience. It, I mean, it can be an emotional experience, but a beautiful experience because then you're able to see things in a different perspective. You're finding out what your purpose is in life. You know, you're, you're learning about different things. You're educating yourself, soaking up things like a sponge. And it's just like, you know, when you when you see things that are, you know, highlighted in your life like that, like or there are certain words that come up in your mind, look them up. Google is my best friend. You know, YouTube is my best friend, you know, because it's just a lot of people that are like minded like me that are having other videos come out that, you know, that I might be going through or things when I'm reaching out to different people's, you know, channels and they're, they got all these things that's going on that I can truly relate to. And it's just like all of us are going through a domino effect to where we're able to resonate with a lot of people and resonate with a lot of things we're going through. So it's just like when you're on that road to self, self-discovery, knowing there's going to be some ups and downs, there's going to be some emotional moments, but it's a beautiful thing when you can finally find out what your true purpose is in life. So, you know, keep going and keep studying yourself. You know, even though you've been with self for so long, there's a lot of things that self didn't know about self. So, you know, you have to engage in that and learn more about it so it can bring, you know, more prosperity to your life, more knowledge to your life, and you'll be able to help yourself as well as others. So I hope you're able to resonate with the content in this video. Much love to you. Sending out infinite abundance, loving abundance to whoever truly needs it. And, you know, healing vibes as well. And um, my post notification shout out goes to Kimber Wolfgang. Much love to you, sis. I hope everything is being blessed for you. Y'all, I'm going to get my live uh, chats back up pretty soon. I've just been going through it, you know, dealing with so many daggone problems. Like, you know, not as in problems like it's in life, but, you know, just basically trying to get my energy back up, having rashes and headaches and all that stuff. It's just been, my body been going through so much and I haven't been able to maintain it yet. So when I get everything straight, trust and believe, you know, the, the video is going to start coming back up daily like I usually do. But for right now, I've been having to take a lot of breaks. So I'm glad that y'all are able to be really patient with me and still hang in there. And I really, truly appreciate it. So I know a lot of y'all are probably going through the same thing. So y'all can relate. So, much love to y'all. Give me a thumbs up, like, and even share. Drop me a line or two. I love to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Even drop me a line and let me know you hit the notification bell so that I can give you a shout out in my next video. And as always, like and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. Much love to you. Peace and be wild.